Well, hello. Well, hello there. <laughs> You're just enjoying our elephants? I am, yeah. It's just pretty neat. At the uh, Little Sable Camp, uh, tent number one. Got a herd of elephants. I counted 26 a minute ago. Uh, that I could see. Yeah. So this is our tented room. And we're going to take a walk up to the front. So as you can see, uh, everything is built on these boardwalks. We've heard that elephants uh, like to try to come through the camp as well. And, uh, well, quite frankly, they will break through these yes, uh, sure. boards as well. They're a little heavy for these. At night, we have uh, a chaperoned. Yes, we are escorted. <laughs> escorted. Um, in the unlikelihood that a lion or leopard were to be in camp, but there's nothing stopping them from getting into camp. Yeah, this is all open. There's no fences. Apparently, last night, around 11 or so, we were asleep, but elephants moved straight through camp. <laughs> Just walked right on through. In between the tents. <laughs> <laughs> so I would say it's pretty adventurous. Yeah, absolutely. It can be cold at night or hot depending on the, the season. Uh, last night wasn't too bad, but the night before was a bit cool. Yeah. Um, I mean, they leg they're, they're legit tents. Yeah, they're tents for sure. Uh, so they put um, hot water bottles in our beds at night. Yeah, which are great. They help a lot. Um, it makes using the outdoor shower kind of a daytime activity. <laughs> at night it's a little bit cool this time of year, which is uh, early June. Uh, start of their winter, beginning of their winter. Um, but yeah, we're on the, uh, I guess we're on the north side of camp which also has the pool and the lookout. And the camp is divided by the main launch in front of us and the tent, other tents are on the other side. There's one of the safari vehicles we've been using. Uh, no, it's right here. Yeah. Take a quick peek at the pool area. You can see it's got two parts. A lookout up top. Where you can see more of the area where those elephants were. And this is the pool. Also with a nice view, little lounge and seating. Yeah, can't see those elephants as well from here, but they're still yeah. over there. Yeah, they're over there. Yeah. One of the fun things I thought, so first thing we do when we get into camp is, uh, well, you might need to have to use the restroom because you've been on a flight for the last couple of hours and then in a, <laughs> a vehicle trying to get you here for about an hour. And these restrooms are worth showing. So you can see the sink area open. And your view. <laughs> no windows. No windows. Nice and open air. <laughs> uh, I'd say the Wi-Fi in camp is pretty good uh, for being in the middle of the bush. I mean, yeah, I mean, there have been places we've come, uh, other lodges we've stayed at that didn't have Wi-Fi in the rooms. This does have Wi-Fi in the rooms, as well as in the main area.
and they're setting up for high tea. There's usually fruit and bread and some snacks. There's always water, coffee, little things set up. And then some seating area. So this is also where we sit for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And then at night, they'll set up fire pits out here, and then seating and fire pits out here. But you are directly in the middle of all the wildlife. There have been multiple elephants that come through the camp, and all of this area is open air. It's been really fantastic. Botswana is gorgeous. Little Sable has been fantastic.